films about God are often banned in the Middle East, while films like Oh My God, God the Secret, who starring Akshay Kumar and Salman Khan respectively, were banned in countries like UAE and Kuwait. Kuwait has already banned the upcoming film Thank God after seeing the trailer itself. Thank God is a social comedy depicting Ajay Devgan as Yamaraj's right-hand man Chitragup. While Thank God has already got a case against it in India, the film stands to lose a few dollars more in the Middle East by not releasing there. Initially, God to see Great was released in 2008 in UAE, but cinemas received orders from the Film Council to stop screening the film, also starring Amitabh Bachchan and Priyanka Chopra. Cinema goers had submitted scores of complaints against the content of the film, as people who saw the film informed authorities that they were shocked to find that Bachchan had played the role of God. The film was also banned in Kuwait and other Middle Eastern countries. A similar case took place with Oh My God when Akshay Kumar was playing Lord Krishna and a similar logic was applied to ban. The basic logic is there is God but one cannot use an actor to depict God. Bollywood stars may be demigods for their audiences but not in the Middle East. Akshay Kumar has had the dubious distinction of many of his films being banned in foreign countries. Apart from Oh My God, his film Padman was banned in Pakistan. The film that was praised in India for raising questions on taboo around menstruation wasn't welcomed in the neighboring nation in the same way. Pakistan's federal censor board banned the film that was about economically accessible sanitary napkins for women. They cited that the Ar Balki film was against their culture and traditions. The film was also banned in the UAE. Do we even need to explain why this Akshay Kumar blockbuster Baby was banned in Pakistan? The film is about the RAW and how they go on a covert mission to Dubai to catch the infamous Pakistani terrorists. The Pakistan censor board banned the film because it apparently showed Pakistan in bad light. The Varun Dhawan and John Abraham star Dishoom was about an Indian batsman going missing. This light-hearted comedy was unliked by the Pakistani censor board. They alleged that the film showed Pakistan in poor light. Akshay Kumar had a cameo in this film too. Bell Bottom starring Akshay Kumar was inspired by real-life airline hijackings that occurred in the 1980s. The film was released worldwide except in Saudi Arabia, Kuwait and Qatar, where it was banned for allegedly tampering with historical facts. Samrat Prithviraj starring Akshay Kumar was released in India and flopped, but it was not released in Kuwait, Qatar and Oman. Another film of his called Airlift was banned in Kuwait.